What's good YouTube? In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to add a game capture in OBS Studio. Super quick, super easy. Let's get straight to it. All right, so the first thing you want to do is come into your OBS software. You want to hit the plus icon right here. And then once you hit the plus icon where your sources are, you want to hit game capture. Once you do game capture, you can name it whatever game that you want it to be named. And then you hit OK. And then once you click that, this will pop up right here and it'll say capture any full screen application or you can capture a specific window, capture foreground window with hotkey. So if you want to make sure you're doing the exact one you want, you can click that and then you can select it right here. And as you see, Fortnite is right there. Once we click that and then you can choose all these different things for scaling if you need it and you can do allow transparency limit capture frame rate you can do all of that stuff in here and get it exactly how you want it and then you can hit okay and then once you enable the preview Duh. All right, so if you run into issues with a black screen like i have in this actual video it's a very easy fix you have to run obs on the exact same graphics processor that you're using for your game so as you can see i have mine set to power saving power saving is the intel graphics which is nowhere near the gts graphics so i'm going to click high performance i'm going to hit save and then i'm going to minimize this and then i'm going to x out of obs and then bring it back up and we should be all good and fine and there you have it a quick easy fix and i did that live and direct for y'all so Mwah. magnificent you can play the game do exactly what you want to do and no issue stream record to your heart's content if this video helped you out please slam the like button subscribe to the channel if you are new and i'll see you all in the next one peace i just wanted to quickly show you that it is in fact working it's not going to be the exact ratio it should be right now for how i'm showing you because i had to make the gameplay window very very small in order to show both different screens at the same time so keep that in mind when you're doing this you'll be playing the game full screen and it'll be looking exactly like it's supposed to be looking in your obs when you're recording and or streaming